Hello everyone and welcome back to our Forge modding tutorial series. Today we're gonna take a quick look at how to update the Forge version of our projects. Um, for that we go to the build gradle and there is a uh, dependency section where you have the dependency of your Forge. <clears throat> so there there should be like this line and the forge version behind here. So um, the actu uh, we're actually gonna look up which forge version is the newest and then take the newest. So let's go quickly to forge. Uh, so file stop micro forge on that, linked in the description. Um, there is the latest version right, right on screen. Uh, so you see the only things that changed uh, from the version number is like the build number so you got to take the build number and replace that with the new one so that's basically it what you have to do now is you're gonna execute the commands again of within the PowerShell uh, or in the command line this is depending on your on your OS uh, you, you type in Gradle, so it's basically the same again. Gradle gen eclipse runs um, eclipse. So this should work now and this will take a while, but this will automatically update um, the forge, forge version number we just put in here. So yeah, see you when this is finished, hopefully. <laughs> So that's it. <clears throat> it took like around three minutes for me to update Forge. Now we can go in here, hit F5, and this should update the reference libraries. Yeah, this is the updated version now. See, it was 1.08 or something before. Now it's 2.19. Uh, that it work well. So now we have updated our Forge versions. I highly recommend you doing so as soon as a new version launches because um, the 1.30 versions um, they have um, some serious bugs in it. So you should be right behind them and update them as soon as possible. So thanks for watching. Um, have a good time. Cheers, see you in the next video.